okay sorry for for the last time um, there is a problem on this uh, dummy image url so i have managed some images from my past project okay so we will define the image path here okay just we have to define image path here so let's create image folder first image folder it's created see now this is my managed image from my past project okay so let's uh, copy this folder to image folder then we have to define the images sorry define the images in the slider js okay so let's add it js uh, img slash slides slash one dot jpeg see slides one two three okay now let's sorry two now we have to add a comma and now three okay this slider now let's reload it and hot and see what happened sorry cannot read property source and got type error again it's showing like that maybe slider custom this source slider let's uh, copy this uh, code i think i have made a mistake Example slides slides sorry for this you have to make slides there not slider now I hope it will work sorry it's a different tab now let's uh, reload this page see now it's working it's totally responsive okay see this is working now we can add different transition effect to the so for that we have to read their documentation uh, settings option so let's uh, first see some transition options there this is the transition index i will provide all of these links in my video description okay so let's uh, see how effects are working see how nice it is okay so let's uh, add this slide left to the transition transition okay you must have to add comma to e after each option okay now let's reload it okay see its style see some kind of parallax type effect now we can add three four type animation in there for that we have to make array mm. okay in the array we have to pass uh, three four type uh, animation name or transition name there then it will show it okay so let's uh, add the name let's see the index of animation where is it uh, those are animation let's add first fade fade type effect fade sorry comma will be after name okay then um, add a bond type effect okay 
you said okay. now uh, let's save it and show it in browser okay let's show it in browser now we load it see page effect is coming now again page now burn effect is started let's see again fade again fade okay this is the style now let's uh, add more uh, and transition okay uh, zoom in zoom out let's add zoom in to transition zoom in now sorry zoom in should be in should be uppercase okay now let's again reload it see zoom in is working now let's wait the time fade zoom in zoom in okay now we can add different type of transition here also for different type of slider okay now here for this i will we'll add slide right okay slide right save it now let's reload it Oh, sorry it's not working here we can add different type transition oops sorry we didn't define the name of the option value okay transition okay now let's uh, reload it see it's slide right but I, I haven't added it in a main transition okay then we can add a different transition to different slide so let's add a, a sorry right to okay now let's uh, reload this page okay second slider will be coming from three some rotating type effect okay so that's it now let's explain again okay first you have to do the markup then you have to install jquery and uh, vegas plugin okay then you have to add base height to your slider element okay like this we have to add 100 bh okay then you have to activate the plugin okay these are animations and transition and uh, slide uh, slider transition okay then you have to call the function and pass the option that's all it's very easy see how amazing slider you can create some two or three minutes okay so that's all i'll keep the source file and the source plugin link to my video description box okay so thanks for watching and uh, if you like my video please subscribe and share my video okay